Derek Druin, NCAA runner-up. Uh, it's twice now you've been the runner-up and uh, also been a champion three times here at NCAAs. Uh, how'd the uh, meet go for you today? I mean, it went well. All things considered, it sucks to lose, but it was probably, it's, it's the first time I've ever made it up to 7-7 seven, seven clean. I want to take that, I want to say that I'm happy with that, and I am, I'm, I'm happy to, to jump 7-7 seven, seven again, but it's always hard. It's always hard to lose. Uh, you had the they had the one miss at uh, 234, went up to 237, had two really good attempts at that. Uh, how comfortable do you think you feel going forward, looking at heights quite up that high? Yeah. Um. I mean, I've only I've only jumped at a height that high once in my life, so I was actually really proud of how confident I was going in and how I I, I kind of just attacked it like it was a bar that I see every day. Um, I think that I really, I really honestly think I could have made that today, which is really encouraging. And now I just have a few more weeks to get ready for trials, and then, and then hopefully by um, London, fingers crossed, I it'll be it'll be a height that I can actually realistically make. And you know, going forward into the Olympic trials, you know, what's going to be the key, you know, just to continue jumping high. Um, I mean, I think that the, like, always it's just to keep doing the things that you're doing. They're obviously working. My last two. Just, or, uh, not including regionals, my last two meets have both been 7-7, seven, seven, which is my outdoor um, PV, so things are working. I, I don't feel like I should change anything now, so just keep on. All right, I know it's a bittersweet, uh, bittersweet end of the meet, but congratulations on uh, your second runner-up finish here. Thank you.